our Saka pet. Hi guys, I'm Roma and welcome to my kitchen. Last week when I was in Toronto, I picked up some sorted mackerel. Today guys, I'm going to show you how I'm going to cook this up with some green banana and some dumplings. So stay tuned. Now let's get cooking. This is the mackerel in here. It's been soaking all night. It's been pickled with salt, and but it's really salty. So you wanna make sure you soak it overnight. And what I'm gonna do next is I'm gonna wash it with some lemon. And when you soak in this too, you wanna make sure like you, um, you change the water at least twice. So you wanna do it before you go to bed, you change it. And then in the morning, you can change it again and put clean water again. You see last week's video where I'm in Toronto and I'm in the little Jamaican store. So this is where I picked it up. So I just rinsed the mackerel real well, put some lemon, fresh lemon juice, make sure it's nice and clean. Once the water is nice and clear, I transfer it to the pot I'm gonna cook it in. And this I'm only gonna cook it out once. You don't have to cook it a long time because it's gonna cook again. So this is really just to make sure it's nice and clean and just get the excess salt out of it. I'm gonna boil it for about 10 minutes and then I'm gonna take it out and cut it up into pieces and then I will show you how I put it all together. Mackerel's cooks and what I'm doing is just cleaning it. So I'm taking out, you'll see there's a layer of like this stuff on top of it. So just gonna clean that off, get rid of all that. Okay guys, so this is what I'm doing, just cleaning it up nicely. Okay, and then I'm gonna finish it off and then I'll come back and show you what it's like when it's all done. These are all the ingredients I will be using. Well, not quite all, but I might add some black pepper, but this is basically what I'm gonna be using for the um, mackerel. I have some scotch bonnet pepper, some fresh thyme, fresh parsley, garlic, onion, some tomatoes, and maggi, and some saison optional. I'll just put maybe a little bit of each one. So this is fresh coconut milk, and I did it last night and kept it in the fridge. You will notice there's some little, the cream, how it kind of separates a bit, but that's fine when you cook it, it's just gonna all dissolve together. So I'm gonna cook the mackerel now. First thing I'm gonna do is heat up the pan a little bit. See the mackerel guys, it's all chopped up and done. I keep the head, I love the head. So what I'm gonna do now is put the coconut milk in the pot. Okay, heat it up. And like I said, this was fresh coconut milk. Okay, this fresh, I did it last night. And now I'm just gonna add all my seasoning, put some tomatoes, onions, my pepper, parsley, everything. And I'll get some green onions later. I'm gonna put all that in there. This is scallion, some pimento, give it a little color and my anato flavor, which is really good with that fish. And I'm gonna put one Maggi. Now I'm not putting any salt. The Maggi's got salt in it anyways, so I don't want it too salt just in case there's still salt left in my fish. So that's it. And I'm just gonna let this cook down Get everything incorporated into it, into the milk, the flavors all together. And we are gonna leave it uncovered. I'm not gonna cover it because if you cover it, it's going to separate right away. So we're just gonna cook it down.
So now you see our coconut is all coming together nicely. It's um, cooking down. It's supposed to come almost like a custard. So we're just going to leave it a couple more minutes and then I'm going to add the fish to it and just let it cook for a couple more minutes after that. So look, and you can see now it's all ready for my fish. It's nice and thick and I'm just going to put it all in there. And the water from that, just put it in, stir it in, and we're just going to leave it for a couple minutes. And the little touch, finishing touch, is a little bit of black pepper on top. Just let it cook down for a couple minutes. And don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And hit that notification bell so you never miss an episode. And here you have it guys, salted mackerel cooked down with coconut milk. Thank you for watching and until next time guys, have a great day and God bless.